I just got a what if that might be interesting and is part of the series I've been making about Arclix B. Build your own ISO. So based on our scripts, you can add 4000 packages from Chaotic AOR, or you can add personal files, or you create packages and put it on your own Nemesis repo, your own personal repository on GitLab, GitHub, anywhere, and then incorporate it into the system, the operating system, incorporate it into the ISO. I'd like to make a rising of Plasma, use the files that we uh, think that are important in the personal folder, so we can just copy them over. And in the third phase, we'd like to package it, put it inside a package and say to Nemesis repo, there is a package for Plasma, please use that particular uh, package to design to rise Plasma out of the box. So basically we want a personal plasma, however we can. First things first, phase one, I need a pristine, a virgin-like plasma. So we need to install plasma. We start from the ISOs that we've been building a week ago. We install it and from there we start. So let me first go through the motions and then freeze the video, pause the video, till everything is installed, rebooted. We rise, change the look, see what we need to do to change it. This has been explained on Carly, where we, arclixiso.com website, where we changed from XFCE to Plasma, from Plasma to Cinnamon. It's all about the configs, figure out what do we need for cinnamon to look nice, what do we need for XFC to look nice, will we keep the default Arch Linux look? No. Will we keep the default Arch Linux of Plasma? Sure, right? looks great out of the box, but sometimes you want to have yeah, your own distro, your own look, right? your own rising. And I know there's somebody already busy uh, with his own uh, look, so this will help him as well. There is always somebody becoming a distro builder, an ISO builder university. So let's go for offline, install grub, doesn't really matter what we choose. We need to get a working system. I won't stay in a virtual, in a live environment. that one as well and then we can pause the video and we'll back if we reboot when we reboot is there something we can do in the meantime well we can open Vivaldi and just keep close other tabs my personal Arclix sorry <laughs> Eric the bucket up and be creative in the naming. I have an idea. I'm gonna call it power. You say what? Okay, this is, this is okay. Never mind. So power is gonna be the name of the package. Okay. I've got myself a GitHub called power. I go to here. I go to the data folder. The data folder contains all my stuff. Get all personal GitHubs. Very simple thing. And that's the only one I get from the internet. Power. Save. Basically, it says for the name in this array, do count uh, one, two, three, four, five. And then I'm gonna git clone the name. The name being LS Fork, Arclix Nemesis, Calamaris. And that's all I need. All the other 160, 170, I don't know. All the other GitHubs, I don't care. And this one, these ones as well, I see. Uh, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. No, I don't want those. <laughs> so all the Edu stuff, although. Let's see. Where is he going to put it? 
No, I don't want these. They're all in here. Ah, yeah. Home data edu. That's okay. So they're already there. So I'm going to run number one. It's going to get power. And that's all. There was a Calamaris update there, I think. So this is a folder. Arclix has their own folders, their own packages. So we have already something that we can copy paste. That's always fast. Desktop Plasma Nemesis. This is what we have as a structure. Control A, that's not good. Um, these three go in here. Control V. And I copy paste something from, from something recent. Something recent, this is recent. This one, that one, and that one. Uh, replace, replace. Readme has now this logo. So this is the power rising plasma. Okay, blah, blah, blah. All the rest can go. Eh? The rest is just blah blah. Although, let's include that as well. It may be interesting for people. So, this is the structure of the computer system. So, I know in five years' time, I still know what is going where. ETC, SCAL, there's a dot config with all this in there, and there is a local with all that in there. And we have XTG about distro RC. We'll have a look if that's needed, if we want it, überhaupt, right? So all of this is something we figured out for Plasma. We're gonna see and create our own package for the rising. But the structure is actually quite similar. Okay, so let's set up my elements that's the setup script just saying hi Merrick and that's where everything needs to go and we're going to update everything online and we're gonna call it copy paste from Arclonex plasma okay that's done I'm gonna shut down. This takes time, right? I'm gonna mess it up, so I'm gonna clone it. I need to test and test and test and test and test again till I'm happy with the code. So I'm gonna test in the clone thing. Actually, this is too soon. This is too soon. Why is this too soon? We haven't updated. We better go inside update otherwise I have to update every single time again right so the clone has to be an up-to-date system all right we are here we're gonna stop this one otherwise we see it again and again remember our way of working in virtual box right control F right control F it works on our clicks. Control T update 300 megabytes. These ISOs were built seven, nine, ten days ago. <laughs> New Linux kernel. To speed up my work, maybe later on, you know, this takes time building these two guys. And these two guys, I don't need them. Not on my real machines, real metal machines, and not on VirtualBox. There is no Broadcom and there is no RTL. So once that's done, 
when it is finished I'm gonna remove it because otherwise every time it takes a time uh, a while right to install these DKMS modules and I don't need I have to wait for something I don't need not okay Six seven five. Okay. Fine. <coughs> bye bye. It's not the megabytes, it's the time. I see a lot of messages like this. If you don't want to see them anymore. These B ISOs are always minimal ones. So make init CPIO firmware. If you install those, look at the names. Can we deduct it? Maybe Q logic to Q. Maybe, all right. So you see the messages here are gone. Here they are the messages and bye bye the messages. It's just a warning. It's okay. You can keep it. It's just not nice, right? Users always have questions. Ah, it's gonna be gonna break. It's gonna break. Yeah, it's just a warning. Key. Okay. Hmm. Reboot. Much too long. Much too too much letters. Pseudo reboot. As are. All right. Looking good. Update last time. Very good. And then this is for me the original system on which I will work. I will clone it, break it, test it, remove it, clone it again, etc. etc. Several times until I'm happy with the result. So it's cloning the thing. Um, ah, yeah, we wanted to go here to the website. So there was some stuff that I had added for the for fun here. Power rising plasma follow 1k uh, 1k is probably for my own we'll have to see maintained yes last commit some stuff here and we also have the logo of NixOS that we've copied now so we'll change that little thing into where are you let's go here we have on Arclinx nemesis in the readme also something interesting and it gives us some information about lots of stuff we can keep this for instance control C and we're gonna go overwrite everything up here and we call it power rising example or plasma save push it back online I'm gonna call it new readme and have a look yep that was the big one I used to have a big one and now I have a small one I think it was an s better power rising example for plasma maintained yes commit and so on discord online telegram followers star forks and so on lots of information the information is correct let's have a look at the code it's pointing to Arclinx nemesis right so we are actually should be pointing it to 
just power just power so we're tackling everything <laughs> not just uh -huh. so this is power safe discord that's cool telegram that's cool github followers from edit what that's cool adclix nemesis power let's go for a control h and then power replace find we keep this because that's where the image is arch linux tool sure youtube channel fine okay okay so it's not about nixos configurations at all it's about power well actually it's up there right no need to tell it again it's up here and all the rest we need to change some text then. delete <coughs> example how you can arise plasma save the files package the files that's the goal all right save back online we'll have to write a little bit more later but we won't spend the time in writing things down right A war has nothing to do here, but okay. That's that. In the meantime, the clone is there. Okay, let's have fun. Let's start rising. Maybe it should do something first. I've explained that in another video. And um, it's all about VirtualBox and its settings. You can tell them to have a shared folder and share it and if and all you have to do is type three letters that's all you need to do v p m we should have done that in the other <laughs> setup okay we're in the glow now you log out login And then we have hopefully Thunar. I rely on Thunar all the time. Yes, if you log in and log out too fast in Plasma, not on real metal actually, but on virtual machine, yes, that sometimes happens, but it will come through, but way too long. So one minute or something like that. So I press Control R, right Control R, and reboot to skip all those seconds. So, this is Dolphin, okay. Do we have Thunar? We did not have Thunar. Because I think Thunar will actually provide me more. There you are. The SV box. This is my system. This is Arcanix. This is me making a folder on Arclix. So this is me making this folder right here. This is me deleting the folder. So it's my transfer system. Out of VirtualBox to Arclix, package the file, etc. Okay. So we're back here. If I press F5, he refreshes. And it says there's nothing there anymore. Okay, design. Before I do anything, 
and look at the files, the hidden files. There's no plasma stuff here. For each desktop that I've made, 30 desktops, 30 plus desktops, I do exactly the same thing. Start from the beginning, make, well, ensure that whatever, wherever the data, the configurations are, that I have a copy. So config backup and local, control C, control V, local backup. Melt is installed with typing Velo. Melt, Sublime Text and a lot more interesting stuff will get installed. So Melt is there. I can do a right click and no, a left click, left click, and then later on Melt. But nothing has changed yet. So folders have no differences. Now I'm going to change. Okay, got an idea. Let's go to this. Let's be blunt. Let's be not creative. Let's be use the work of somebody else. All right. Now, not I've shown you this theme. It's in one of my videos. It's okay, but um, I prefer the Apple look. We've made an Apple look at some point in time. What if I wanted something like that? Some kind of Apple look. Then oh well, find it again. But he had a bar at the bottom. And there is so many things like right? utterly sweet solid. I understand that some people like this and all respect to them, but not for me. Oh, the question is, which one is it? Might have been this one. So the top here has the menu and the bar here. Let's see if I oh, close the wrong thing here. Can I, can I, can I, can I show the highest rate is first? Ah, it's the one. It's uh, ah, yeah, from Vince, Vince Lewis. Vince Lewis. Anyway, he's a very uh, talented guy. Um, so, 7.9 out of 10, 13,000 downloads. He's, he's really is the max, right? 19,000 as well here. Let's have a look. Do want my system, my future system, to be looking like this. Why not, right? Looks nice as well. Has also a bar, a lot of transparency in it. It's north, so the color system is the color of the north scheme. Apple Monterey. Okay, did not sell it to me. Utterly north, Apple Ventura. Utterly sweet. Utterly north solid. No, I think I'm gonna go for the other one. So take your time because it's fun, All right? This is the fun bit. <laughs> Make it nice. Mac OS Big Sur. Okay. All right, Vince. Ah, right. it's gonna be you. Although, what's the other one? This one was um, utterly north. Was actually also quite attractive. So I have to choose. Choosing is losing. So utterly north by Himdeck. I have the reflex to do control T Y utterly north. Oh my God. A global theme for Plasma 5 with transparency, blur, rounded edges for Windows Bird. Okay, baby. Why not make this package and put it on our Arclex Nemesis, the personal repository? Sure. Then we can add it immediately and see what we get. Okay. 
utterly ignored plasma. So we've got another idea. What if I take control T, yay, utterly ignored, and now was it again? Plasma. Number one, I install it. He wants to know this. Wow. No, right? This is the ISO builder. I don't want this particular application filling up all my things here. This, it will be installed on my system. I'll do it differently. Control Shift C. I'll build it in Shroot. That's something, of course, you don't have. Um, but I just want to keep a clean ISO builder, right? So sorry about that, but I'll put it in here. The third party packages. I'm gonna git clone. And that goes away. What was the name again? Utterly. So a U. Oh, you, 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 you. Utterly, 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 utterly. So make package minus SI or yay or Peru and you got yourself a package. I just don't want all the packages on this ISO builder. Uh, here, utterly. Now we go. Save, quit. In the package build. These are just procedures, basically get me all no get me all the githubs now utterly is there one more and then we'll go check and then a package build copy build file to all folders that's the file that's gonna build it because otherwise I have to move everything from A to B in all the time so I built me myself in shroot right so somewhere hidden away in a yeah, folder that is basically a small little Arch Linux, an Arch Shroot, building in Shroot, Arch Wiki built in Shroot, and have a look. So all these packages cannot harm my system. They will not be installed in the ISO builder. They are in a, in a separate folder. All right. So now it's on the Arcanlex repo third party. Basically, the output of the script is in a repository already. And all I need to do is sign them. That's true. Sign is normally the thing I'll do. But in this case, it's not necessary because I'm going to move it. This one. Well, let's, let's keep it on the third party as well. But basically, we wanted to have it on. I'll do. I'll do a cut. I'll do a cut. Right. Put it here for later, and copy here. And we're gonna put it on the Nemesis repo. So we have our own Nemesis repo. If you go to the website, it's all explained. Nemesis repo, your own personal repository like ALCI has one, like Carly has one, like Arcanlinks has one, like Endeavor OS has one, like Manjaro has one, right? Everybody has a place to put their apps, basically. That's called repository. Let me explain it how to do that. So, okay, where were we? Where were we here? Nemesis repo, and I'll put it in here. The signing is not done, it's just a misery. Don't start with signing. Keys, right? So we have utterly Nord Plasma, a package called package tar zst. That's the one you can install. I don't know what it's gonna do, and that's the fun. That is the fun. We upload everything to github.com, Nemesis repo, and later on we can say, I'd like to have the utterly Nord Plaza package, please. And see what it does. Aha, uh -huh. that's another way of working. All right. 
Now it's first to see what do we get and what extra do we want. We want some settings for Dolphin, Console. Yeah, we want to have a nice Console design. We're always in the terminal. That ah, should be awesome, right? And that's what you need to think about. What do I want now? Let's keep things going. So, what we can do, close window, V. What we can do is look at our N Pacman thing. So if we press update, what do we see? We don't see the Nemesis repo. Easily fixed, you say. ATT, run it. It's a button to click. How easy can it be? A button to click to have the Nemesis repo, Pacman click and quit update now we have the nemesis repo Git when, github is not the fastest when it comes to repositories so let's see if it finds already utterly north plasma all right it found it it's installed and now what what happened to my system? I've got myself a, here you are. I got myself some extras. Appearance. Where are you? Utterly not solid. Appearance settings, desktop and window layout. From now on, everything will change. Apply. Knowing what I know, I'm gonna reboot, if I can. The clock is in the middle here, and let's put it up there. Voila. I can't reboot, there is something wrong with the menu. Add widgets and so on. Super X is still active. Restart, let's see, ooh, too much restart. Anyway, we need it to restart. And see if it's gonna apply things better. That's already nice. That's a wallpaper. Where is my menu? Where's the dock? There seems to be a lot of things missing. Too bad, right? Bad choice. How do I get to my system settings? The menu is not there. Add widgets. Menu. Application menu. Now it's there. At least I can get to my stuff. I see one thing. System. Utilities. Utilities, no. System settings. Oh. What's the name again? The system settings. Here, system settings. Ah, yeah. So let's try to fix this again. Appearance. If we did this, we have desktop. Choose what to apply. Desk colors, application style, window decorations, icons, plasma style, cursor style switcher, splash screen. Apply. Is it safe to assume that minus s that maybe we need latte doc? I don't know. We need to go and 
investigate. Let's do a logout. Okay. She's gone now. So I definitely think we need to go and investigate at widgets. No. That takes too long too much time. System, where was it again? Settings and then system settings. Testing system settings. Yes, yes, yes. Where are you? Oh. That one. Is there a link to the designer? What did we do wrong? There's no link here. Unfortunately, not. Right mouse click. No. Utterly not solid. Utterly not solid. What are we missing? Is there an application that we're missing? Is there anything missing? That's what we have. And this is these things you can add. Right, always interesting. Net speed widget. Simple kick off in top panel. Better kick dash in dock. Don't have all of them. Right? We don't have them. So a simple kick off in top panel. What's that? That's this. Okay. Control T. Yay. Simple kickoff. What do we get? Simple unacquired launch for Wayland. That's not what we want. For Wayland, for Wayland. Close window. Get it from KDE store. Let's see. Better application improved fork of kicker. And we called it something else here. Okay, better application menu. Yay, better application menu. Nope. Better application? No. It's a nice menu, right? It would be nice if we could have that. Simple kickoff for plasma. If you download the file extracted in open terminal directory containing the metadata desktop file, execute the following command. Let's see. If you downloaded the file, Download. Ah, behind it. No, no. Open the file. Do like these icons. They're better than the previous ones. Extract archive yeah. subfolder. Meta, where's the meta? Meta, 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 this one. And then open in terminal, Control Shift V, enter. 
missing value after install. What did we do? Missing value after install. No, there is nothing more. I wonder what I'm missing here. I feel this is gonna be too long, right? This is not gonna work. This is not the intention of the video anyway. Not everything was installed. It would take us too long. The video is already 41 minutes. That's way too long already. So I need to find something better, better design that actually works out of the box. So you are out, cancel, delete. Let's go to that one, apply. And I've got new global team. Don't tell me I have to go for Windows. <gasps> Don't tell me that. Ah, most downloaded, Adapter KDE, New Mix, we've seen that too. This one was it. That was the one. 144,000, that's the one. Monterey. Yay, Monterey. Out of date. All right, never mind then. Let's do an install and see that it works. What I also have to do in the meantime is a sudo pacman minus remove utterly and so on. So my dear friends, you're out. Let's clean you out from the third party. You are definitely out. Utterly. Allez. Utterly. There you go. You're out. You'll never be downloaded again. You're out. And in the third party, I put you separately. And you're out as well. That means that the repo data, the do the nemesis repo has no longer utterly not. All bad. Gone. Bye. Cheers. Good riddance. Ooh, we got there. Yeah, the debus, yeah. Arch changed the debus broker backend thing and um, I guess it will be up to the users to go and fix things at some point in time. We're back in the running, but this is nice. This is what I remember. Although, use the menu at the top is still the menu that we used to have, and this is still the same. Logging out is impossible. 
let's see if we log out and we see the same thing again. The thing I'm now thinking is this, this is not good, right? This is not a clean system anymore. We've broken it by selecting something that didn't work. Let's see. Yeah, I got this vibe, the vibe that says stop, shut down. Let's start from scratch. Remove, delete plasma. Let's um, type VBM there. What was it? There was another thing I had to do. VBM. That's it, I think. So to share folders in guest and host. That's that. Oh, yeah. I think it was the sudo pacman minus r rtl8. Uh, S Y and I'll remove broadcom ah they're gone already okay cool so just VBM and shut down shut down I have to go through the motions again eh? so we're gonna clone things again we know which one we need to install but first we need to backup can I do something else in the meantime yeah we need the package build we have desktops and we have package builds for desktops and they're all online and there is one for plasma there is one for plasma. This one, control C. I'm gonna put it in data. That's my personal one. In edu, control V. Everything is named as edu, edu what? So basically it's not Alex, it's me just playing around. This is called dubbed power. So edu power kit. And now we do the same here. Let's have a look. Fine. Package build. Instead of plasma, control H. We put power, replace, replace. Uh, let's add power behind here. Find. So it's going to go to the GitHub from Eric Dubois. And it's called power. And the same up here. Let's call it edu power. Package name edu power. Probably need to revisit this if that's correct or not. But for now, it's gonna conflict with this. Arconlex. And it's also gonna conflict with plasma git. So this tells Pacman. If I want to install this package, then it's gonna say this one needs to go, that one needs to go, because they conflict with each other. And you have to say yes, no. And here is Eric Dubois. And then the package name is the variable that's up here. It's called edupower.git. Yes, looking good. If we forgot something in the meantime, We've used our time wisely. It's copy pasted. Okay. So the theme, but first the backup. So this is the clean slate, whatever system it is from whichever uh, distribution, right? You get this from a distribution and then you go mess with it. <laughs> Config, control C, control V backup local control c control v to backup was velo already installed <laughs> i forgot one velo doesn't take a lot of time now we're gonna play around with our settings i took appearance 
I took get global themes, I did show most downloaded first, and I found immediately the one I want. Monterey Plasma Dark Theme fixed. I hope it is. Another Monterey up here. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. <laughs> SEM theme location. We have to remember that. use but first it needs to work that's strange this is okay right the top these little icons up there but this one used to be up here let's log out maybe I redesigned it maybe it's another thing Yeah, I remember distinctly that this thing was up there and we had the bar down here. Wasn't that in the image? So we have here all these things uh, uh, not working properly oh, la, 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 la. it's not up to date when the problem is fixed I'll remove this one facilitate installation without the need to correct the problem every time I install lab why does it say fix then So when local share plasma look and feel, so this is certainly something I need to copy paste over, but is it only this? This is what I want. Where is this? All right. That's a bummer, I think. It has been 10 minutes, months ago. No, Vince, it's not Vince. Let's look, have a look at Sirius, Forge from Vince, and it's a public archive. The last commit was nine months ago. That's a long time ago. In computer time, ages. Okay, so I guess we'll have to go to the fork of Vince Louis, Louis Louise, and we have all that. This looks great, right? Monterey KDE team. We did see something. But it was out of date. That's the theme 2021 08. We have this. 
Oh my God, two years ago, three years ago, four months ago. Four months ago, that's not that long ago. But it's just icons. Just icons. We know Plasma is gonna change pretty soon. Version six. And then everything will change again, probably. We have here something to play with. Download zip. Okay. Extract, 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 extract. Voila. And then it says install ZSH. Install ZSH. You open this and have a look. That's good. We know exactly where everything is going. And Latte. We have it in. Oh no, we don't have it installed anymore. Sudo pacman minus s latte. Was latte doc? Latte doc. So let's install it. We're in virtual machine, right? That's the fun. Who cares? Install finished. That was fast. Now what? Discover what am I opening? Close, close, minimize, close, close. Us. Don't ask again. Close. Close again. And which one is it now? Refresh. Yes, refresh. Um, this one, I think. Let's try again, right? So choose what to apply. All of it. What I want a complete different look. All of it. But I should have a menu, please. Thank you very much. Ah, I have my little apple here. Okay, that's better. I can close this. Why is this thing there? Oh, that's variety, I think. There it is. Where is my latte dock? Why is this so bright? Can I make it less bright? Here it is. No, that's not it. Then we need to go to settings again. And system settings much too bright oh my god so monterey yeah. application style plasma style ah we have a monterey dark why is it not applying oh i hear the button you can hardly see Apply. Apply. Okay, colors. Montre dark. Apply. Better. Window decorations. I do like the the buttons here. Uh -huh, we have different versions. Uh, dark, I guess. Apply. Fonts. Why not make everything a little bit big? for us, right? 11. Okay. Apply. Icons. White Sur. White Sur Dark. Apply. Cursors. I like something white against a black background. Breeze Light. Breeze Light. Apply. There he is. Font Management. Splash Screen. Monterey Dark, Apply, Wood Splash Green, Spinner, Breeze, Script, Solar, Driver, Boa, that's uh, whatever, Spinner is good. So now we have this look. 
Okay. All right. This bar could be different. I don't know how we do that, but this does not match with each other for some reason. It's different. Uh, so settings and then system settings. The border. No. Quantum dark. Can this affect the look? Window decorations. ugly. How do I change the border? Title bar buttons, get new window decorations, Let's see. What will it apply? Ah, a little better. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, awesome. And now, ugly. How do we get this done? This is good, right? For me, this is a nice look. Um, fine. And when we click here, the menu is up here <laughs> from this one. It's just like Mac is, right? You click on an application and then the menu goes up here, but this looks strange. These things, ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. So it was in settings, system settings, appearance, the window decorations. We had these sizes. Eh? different that's not nice let's stick to breeze the color is off the color is off that's better the best solution is our dark, but I don't like the icons and the, the, the buttons are gone. The nice little buttons up here. Mm. I can't think it'd be perfect. Can I change this? And design in size, this is good. But the background is bad. Can I change the background? buttons yes why not bigger let's have a look sure but I want the background to be to have a different color but I don't think window border size don't want to define the size I want to design define the color okay how dark it is. 
for now. That's nice in design. Okay. Where is Lotte? Where is Lotte? Ah, there he is. Or she, or it, or whatever. There it is. When I go here, here, here. Bingo. Um, add to pin launcher. This doesn't look good, right? The color from this thing feels out of place. It's nice that it's transparent, but it's also Monterey dark. All right, let's continue. It's not, well, I'm partially happy, right? Happy enough to proceed. What has changed to our system to make it look like this? Hmm. The video is already one hour. What changed? Config, config backup, right mouse click, melt, compare. We have user feedback. Don't care about user feedback. We have quantum, Monterey, Monterey cave again. These things, I need all these things. Alacrity, I can get Alacrity all the time. So we don't want to see what's the same. We don't care what's the same. This is what we did after installing. And there are fonts that we changed. Hinting a sign. We made it bigger, remember? But mm, not really. It's just changing it from place. Mode assign to last mode assign in the beginning. But basically, no, we're not interested in that file. Colors. All right, let's, oops. Let's put things into action. We need to melt. We need the folder, maybe immediately the one from Thunar. Oops, what am I doing? So let's launch Thunar. So Velo and Thunar in our next iteration, right? We need to install it. Minus S Thunar. So I've got my Thunar. I type Thunar. That doesn't work. I type Thunar. Voila. I have this folder, which will become my config, and this will be my local. Okay. So this I don't need. This is too big. 50 50 if possible a little bit more this one up here and i need one more off to an r new window yes and then down here eric dot config we're ready to go first the dot config so the quantum i need the quantum this one, control C, control V. What else? How to start for Latte? Ah, yeah. Otherwise, no fun for me. Control C, control V. The deconf is less important, so I'm gonna keep that out. Font config, control C, control V. Uh, 
Maybe all the rest can stay as well. They're all good. And that is the configuration. GTK3, GTK3, Control C, Control V. 4 has already been adopted in Plasma. Boom. In there. Feedback, 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 whatever. System settings. I think. That I don't need it. So we'll see later on, right? These are KDE defaults. That's why I say there isn't this plasma is one of the most difficult because all the data is scattered. And yes, you can dump the complete dot confident dot local, but eh, not a smart thing to do. So a latte never use latte on my iso so that will be a first let's see if we need it pulses pulse audio session is session sublime text not interested variety it comes along anyway and now we have some things here that i've never seen before that's empty that's cool that's discover gtk rc that might have to do with yeah, that's unimportant as you see it's empty alternative button sure sure alternative button where are you so rc2 gwen view no kmc input ah oh, yeah this contains something about cursors kcm input rc keep on repeat um jaw i don't want i'm gonna keep leave it out so first as small steps leave things out and test and see and see and see missing something okay add it to the list okay the globals i'm gonna take it a lot of coloring in there and that's what we're doing, right? Design. KDE Globals, KDE Globals, that one. Okay, font. Nope. The shortcuts, yes, we like shortcuts. The hotkey shortcuts as well, background stuff. All variables. I'm gonna put that in as well. Console is fun. Eh? Console is our, our uh, terminal. We're gonna play with it, so yeah, sure. Console. Cast Splash. No. Quinn RC. This we need. We have Aurora, the theme for our dark. So Queen RC, Queen RC, this one. Set something for Arc. Latte Doc. Like I said, my very first thing. This is a problem. We're on virtual box, right? I'm not sure what to do on real metal. It says virtual one. That's this. looking at all the settings I think I'm gonna skip it for now okay the plasma KDE this one the longest name and plasma shell RC is given us No. SEM team installer RC. Oh, look at that.
that's something we need to address we can do that right now it's now on the screen so this is the, this is the config so if I want to make it right then it's gonna be etc and I put these guys in here it's gonna be scale put these guys in here this is called dot config and that will be dot local because now I have another structure I have etc scale Control H. What I need on the future system is also a folder called user. Share SDM themes. Monterey Dark. Voila. We'll have to figure that out where it is, right? User shares the end themes. Monterey Dark, no typos allowed. Okay. Last file, system settings are C. No, that's okay. So that was the config. Then there's the local. The local. Uh, that was not smart. Super F5. Let's go back and just switch from local to local backup. Uh, can't click it. Ah. Open. Not like that. Seems to be a lot of stuff. In the meantime, we make a folder called share. And in the folder share is interesting stuff. So we go to local. Share Aurora. That's interesting. So local share control C control V. This one is covered. Baloo, we don't need Baloo. Color schemes, Monterey and so on. Color schemes, control C. Control V. Dolphin, that's interesting. Dolphin is our file manager. We want to set our file manager. That's the dustbin, Gwen view, icons. Oh, look at that. Yes, put a lot of icons in there. Mm -hmm. Icons up. Uh, Cancel. Oh, 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 oh. Control C, Control V. Skip all. Okay, that will take a while. So those are all the icons. Oh my God. Let's close the directory. This one is an important one. Control C, Control V. Those are databases with settings. Cookie jar. <laughs> it's empty, so never mind. History 2, Clipper, no. K new stuff, what's that? K new stuff. There is a registry for coloring and icons and look and feel but doesn't contain the name of the designer Monterey Plasmi Dark yeah we need it 
that's for a look new stuff okay new stuff three okay new stuff three this one control c control v oh my god they're still copying so that's covered wallet no melt no plasma plasma the whole folder of plasma needs to come i saw a lot of icons there Control c Control v uh, skip all we'll see if it works the log wallpapers uh, yeah monterey has wallpapers Control c Control v Okay, runner and recently used done then we had the one place user share SEM themes Monterey dark let's navigate to it as well file system user share SEM Teams and then Monterey Dark. Yeah? Monterey Dark, yes. Control A, Control C, Control V. Okay. We better have a look and our downloads in here. What did it do? He is going to create a source directory. A source directory. Copy source directory to Aurora. So these are the directories. We need to have more. This we have done. Eh? The local, let's check the local. There's more to do for the other one. Um, yeah. So Aurora check uh, yeah that's how he does it we could have we could put it here as well if you want we can write everything there now we're putting everything in local share which is actually not a bad idea so local share you can delete it and otherwise it's hidden away you find it easier in your home directory so aurora color schemes check dolphin no nope check but plasma desktop check and local share plasma look and feel check check and config quantum we have got that as well and local share wallpapers this is all there and that's there if we want it depending on the root id if you're sudo then it goes there and otherwise just Eric, plain Eric, then it's gonna be here. Since we don't, we did not miss anything. Eh? Ah, the Latte, Latte Doc. Goes to Latte Dir, where is Latte Dir? Latte Dir, here. Config Latte, we got that, huh? We got it covered, Latte. Okay, anything else? Lot it is make directory schemes x resources. Ah, he has x resources. Yo, what does it contain? This x resources. Oh, nothing, right? We have a longer list, so let's keep ours. Yeah, I think we have it. This is install. We can always come back, so let's circle back. So this would be our package. Working on this, Monterey KDE main and K 
keep track of his changes and then we adopt melt eh? super easy melt and change everything again or maybe cut ourselves loose and change the settings ourselves okay I seem to have forgotten something I don't know what this is what we have use of share SDM themes no can't recall what I need to do is this okay that's that I'd like to have at some point in time an exit button down here somewhere but okay so we sh well we keep it open or we shut down we're gonna shut down we're gonna shut down and voila this thing will be our reference point and we needed to install Velo Melt some things eh? yeah so Velo Melt is included in this thing um, or something else don't recall it's gone again I should write everything down my memory is not what it was it used to be so with this we clone again and voila the other one is called reference so we clone this one again let's make a package on the virtual box vbox shared everything is what i need is there what i need so let's do control c let's keep it there let's go to data and then go to power power and control Control V. Then you see there's something new, the user folder. This one is the old one. Always interesting to have a look. What does ArcLinux save? And what do we save now? Now we also have a quantum, but it's a separate package. Huh? How to start it's now? Font config is new, JDK3, 4. KD defaults, new template for Latte. We did not do this. Ah, I think we better do this. It contains the cursor theme and all that. I had a except, yeah, I skipped that one. So the K settings D, K settings D dot conf. Maybe we should go get that one. Dolphin RC is not here. This is here. We don't have that. that. <laughs> this and this we have. That we don't have. That we have. So some of the things that we are having. Aurora, of course, is not as new. Eh? The, the design is all new. And all these icons. This we have. Can you stuff? Console. We have a console. That's true. For Arco Art Dark. We'll create something new. Okay, now this is a choice. We go grab the, the files that we're comparing here that are different. Or we just build now already and we'll see later. I'm gonna go for one hour, 29 minutes. I'm gonna go for etc old, I'll put it online, but I'll never build it, I'll never use it. I use this one, I use that one, but this stays there just as reference. Okay, good idea. 
It's a work in progress. It's fun. It's thinking. It's analyzing. Uh, we need a name. Monterey, I think, or something. Monterey team. Yeah, Monterey. Or in, in uh, Spanish, Monterey. The king. The king in the mountains. Okay, let's call it like that. The king of the mountains. Um... That's online. Maybe next thing is the package build. We're gonna build XDG, we don't have that. So let's um, write things again. Where do we have code? Nowhere, no code anywhere. So it was user share. SDM plasma no themes or something themes let's see user share plasma themes user share system themes and then we have this one no oh. see this one save so we're gonna use destination three fine coming from Eric Dubois power yes local share dot config uh -huh. power Let's see. First, you don't use this script. First, you try and see what happens. So make the package. Missing dependencies, K init. Had not looked at the dependencies. Where are the dependencies? Depends K init. Bubble. Okay. Okay, in it. Fine. I'll just have to remember to delete this one. It's just the one, right? Ah. What's this? Cloning username. Control C. Let's have a look. The website we push everything to is this one. That's the line. Control C. Let's refresh. And then you see that we have etc old, etc scale. Uh huh. Okay. So this is the line that I need to get into my config, into my package build. Super F. The website is gonna be this there's no error and the package name watch out Eric watch out power not edu power right the source line 19 points to underscore package name which is this I actually have to tell them no it's actually this but we're gonna package this the, the name of the package is gonna be edu power git but the github is power so that actually makes no sense and that with, with that I can explain you something more you can always change it edu power then everything stays the same edu power okay that means, and it's always tricky if you do things like that, that means that you need to go inside this one, edu power git, yes, control H, uh, no, not that one, this one, yeah, control H, GitHub, config, and there is a line in here, 
that points to a certain place and it has to be edu power now safe okay now did i change the edu power no <laughs> so back to edu power it is i <laughs> super f not super t uh -huh. and let's try build it Let me go check. A failure occurred because I want to copy everything that's in Monterey Dark. Source, ADU Power, ETC, no, user, share, SEM, themes, Monterey Dark, yes, and all of that. Cannot stat, no such file or folder. Cannot stat in edu uh-huh you see it it says here edu power user where's the slash where is the slash the slash is gone so back to the package build i did something to the Let me look again. Edu power slash user. Edu power. Come on, Eric. Ah, here. The slash. Found it. Safe. Okay. Did it did it? It's always tricky. Always a challenge. No, you will you will not install it. <laughs> Whew. So you get an edu power git that has an etc that has a scale that has a config that has an all of this. I will add more if we need more. We have local, we have share, and we have all that. Okay, and as well in user share, this is our license, and then SEDM themes, Monterey Dark, and we've got all that. Looking good. Bye. And now I'm gonna build it for real. delete i did copy paste it no i did not copy paste the right one it goes to arcolinks repo so the edu stuff has their own build their own build oh 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 What am I doing? Confusion. Confusion, confusion. This one is edu power. And this one needs to go inside here. But there is already an edu power git and that one is the package build and all the package builds go in here and all the githubs go in there voila we're back the way it should be order order let there be order so this is our code and the package build goes in the package build and there we find the 80 power git and now i'm gonna build it In shoot. Okay, in it. Eh? <laughs> Do we need it? Not really, yeah. We're gonna install it on plasma, right? 
So depends. Sure, it depends on K in it. But right, big. Which makes our building a little bit smaller, faster, not smaller, faster. I just told you we're going to be faster. Yeah. Oh, why is he going to put it on Arcanlex repo? That happens when you do things double. So our intention is not that it goes on the Arclinks repo. This is my personal project. That's a mistake. You're out. Solved. But the build that we need is not that one. The build that we need is any of the other guys. Well, build data. One hour, 41 minutes. OMG. Keep going. Who knows, somebody can learn something from it. So it's going to be on Nemesis repo. Better, much better, much, much, much better. I need to get it online. These are all the package builds. Nemesis repo is now online. If you want to know the package build that I just created, it's now online. And the other ones as well. <laughs> so we got ourselves a package called Edu Power Git. That defines some of the things, maybe not all, but certainly some of the things from Arclex. What we can do by way of tests, we'd like to build our own plasma for sure. So this one, we'd like to build our own plasma at some point in time, desktop. Instead of the packages from Arc Linux, control find Arc Linux. Plasma. Let's keep the services in. That's interesting. But not that. We'd like to keep in the edu power git. That's the one we want. Okay. But that's for later. That's building ISOs. All, although, although. Let him do his job, right? Let him do already something. I'd like to do something else first. I'd like to target not found, okay? Because, my dear friends, it's on the personal repo. True. We're not installing anything from Chaotix repo, just from the personal repo. And now it depends is GitHub awake? Did he add the package? And there he is, Ideal Power Kit. So that's building. I'd like, like to do first a start from this one. And at this point in time, the CPU is not working very hard. It's at the very end when he's building ISO, every CPU goes 100%. So now I can still do some tests. And I'd like to launch the Arslinks tweak tool. I like to activate, if it's not activated, the Nemesis repo. And then 
quit control T update nemesis repo comes in pseudo pacman minus remove anything for Arclex plasma hit that's out there will be other packages I need to go to remove, but he'll tell me. So minus s edu power git. And there he goes. So he's telling me what I should remove. Control T. So basically building the ISO is not possible. Pseudo Pacman minus remove. Arcolinx quantum. Needs to go. What else? Arclinux config plasma. What else? Oh yeah. Arclinux variety auto start. What else? Oh, the conky session. Arclinux, I don't want it either, so fine. Conky election, uh huh. And then we have the color schemes. Eh? Arclinux GTK3 and we don't want does that, yeah. Plasma, plasma. Those are the lines, I think. So that means that we need to add some, well, remove some things, and the build would, would never be successful because he says eh, conflicting this, conflicting that. So we need to go to the Arch ISO, to the packages. Control find, plasma. Ah yeah, latte. We need to have latte at the end. Latte doc. Right, plasma. The conkeys, you're out. Strike three. Uh, another, another plasma stuff here. You're out as well. There was something about variety. Arclinx variety, 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 variety. V, 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 V. Variety, auto start. You're out as well. Save already. So the conkey collection, ah, yeah, GTK3. Did we do that? The GTK3 stuff is out. Check. Quantum. This one is out. Save. Variety is there. Ah, yeah, Arclix config. Arclix config here. Arclix config plasma. Out as well. Let's see. Here we got something. The five lines. If they're okay, we can move away and let it do its job. Line number two. All right. He's building, but I want to see what it will look like. So those are gone. And mine is in, minus S. Let's make this bigger. <laughs> it do power. Git. All right. You know where it is? It needs to scale. So you type scale. And then we reboot. Not log out, let him reboot. Let's see what we get. Okay. All right. Where 
Where is my latte? Donde esta mi latte doc? And it always takes time, I think, right? A few seconds. Is it slower always? Or is it not launched? It's not coming. No, it's not launched. Should be launched. Why? We could put it in the auto start. In the config, in auto start, we had Latte. So, why is it not starting? Ah, yeah. No. Latte is installed. Oops. Pseudo Pacman minus S Latte. On my ISO, it will be installed. Log out. Log in. Let's take another wallpaper. <laughs> Don't you have anything else? Come on, the fishies. We still love the fishies. We have our icons. We should add more stuff to it. Gimp, Inkscape, uh, whatever you like. So we have immediately our setup. This is. This is. And this is. Okay. And that's that. Looking good, so starting to get something in. We go to settings, the system settings. But we'll start again from scratch, from, let's see in the icons. It is why it's so dark. This is not our cursor, it's true. We've changed our cursor. This is Bibata. So somewhere is a setting. And I think I took this one, right? So we need to figure out where the setting is and then copy paste it back to the other. The boot splash was gone as well. I can actually like Monterey Dark to see that, but not this one. You have a spinner, but the splash screen, it's nice to be greeted with an Apple logo, right? <laughs> Knowing we don't have to spend one dime for it. All right. Well, getting there. Two hours video. O M G. Second time I say that. Stop saying that, Eric. All right, I'll do this deal with you. Let's continue next week or sometime. And we have the package, everything is set, everything is laid out. The only thing we need to do is install again, clone again, See what we're missing, the packages that we're missing, same procedure, same workflow, copy of config, copy of local, get everything out of my guest and into my host, put it online in GitHub, package it, put it there, build it. So it's interesting to end the video with the result as an ISO form. And it's still busy. So that means I'm gonna stretch my legs and never have I made a video this long. Hopefully, right, it gives you some idea how distributions, how systems fit together, workflow ideas. I'm still not done with the old ETC, so I'm gonna check which files matter for Plasma to have a beautiful look. 
first impression is everything so basically I can make a clone and call it power from now on we have an ISO we don't start with Arclix anymore that's unimportant we keep building on what we have I'm gonna keep the reference so if I there's something I thought it was different or something then we'll check this one and this can go as well and prime can go as well voila pause time all right the ISO is out we've created something new always fun creating something new and that's why we have ALCI and that's why we have a riser and that's why we have Carly it's another way of looking at things and learning from it so no not the place to be Arclix out is in the B ISO look at the time always check date time like a few minutes ago start go start in English start in Dutch We are almost two hours, but I do like to have my cursor set. But okay, we can first go and work on it another day. Oh, nice, right? Awesome. I bought myself an apple. Really? Yeah. That takes a while. All right. <laughs> Yucky. That's Yakowaki. That tries to show up. Hmm, I have 12. Yes, thank you. I'd like you to have it, but could you stay away? Right? I don't know. We'll see. This color and that color is different. Hmm. How to start? And then, of course, we go for an installation. But we don't need to install to know what's going on. Eh? We have this. Let's look. We have the system settings that we have saved. That's good. I wanted to have that. So Monterey Dark is a selection. Application style is Quantum. We could decide for Quantum Dark, but I'm not going to change anything yet. Monterey Dark. Monterey Dark. Window decorations arc normally. Yep. Yeah. Fonts. Yes, 11. Icons. White search dark. Cursors. That's the one we need to fix. Next time. It's just a file somewhere. So not that one. I'd like to have the breeze light. Splash screen. Seen it. Boot splash screen spinner. Cool. Cool. Cool result. But as you see, it takes two hours already to do this. So we need to keep on working. And design wise, there are some things I'd like to change. I know that's possible, but we do have the code. The code is here. All the design that we'd like to change is in here. The desktop theme, the look and feel and yeah, we have the data. We're in control of settings. So we'll see. We're already quite far. 
variety is nice but one of the things I was thinking is when I was on NixOS I've made a series about NixOS I did this as a setting and I really liked it I did the setting of slideshow and then random scale scrubbed uh, thing here, yeah, I think this one, and then apply. So each time you come on, there's always another wallpaper, but from the plasma selection, not from a variety. So that's something to think about. Ideas, get ideas. What do I want from my system? Do I want this little clock or not? Or is that the only way to quit Latte? I suppose so. So we'll have to keep it. But voila, the video is two hours, long enough. I promise not to do anything about the code that's not eh, recorded. I'll record everything and share it with you guys. This is our new look. Well, look at it when in a week or so and then we come back and say oh no that's not nice maybe smaller icons I don't know we can set it maybe a little bit smaller do some things here play around with rising basically all right cheers for now